heart cancer tumor in, my, in the back of my back. It grew about the size of a basketball. It was so hard. It was starting to squeeze off my airflow. In my voice box, I could hardly speak. Put <laughs> some Crisco oil and some some uh, starting fluid. I put some of that on there. And I rubbed it into my flesh. And the tumor and all went all over my uh, and my neck sit on the, and the night before and I slept with that. Slept with it on there. During this time I was also visiting a, uh, 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 um, a magic uh, guy uh, in, in, he was a, a healer, yeah, and, uh, and in Tijuana, Mexico I went down there and, <laughs> and I had to see what he could do to shrink the tumor a little bit because it was getting kind of big. And I went down there for an entire year. He combined his special massage technique with a regiment of calisthenics where I ran around the block repeatedly. <laughs> I opened up the cellular and the vitamin energy, VHF, HF stuff, and it and, and just took 12 days after that for the tumor to almost completely go away. It was just the size of a gumball in like two months. <laughs> So over the top, man. I mean, you tired me out, dog. I mean, you had me exhausted. I was just like reeling. A really bit graphic. Maybe too much emphasis on the tumors and not enough on the cellular energy. It was a total waste of my time. I don't know where what planet he came from, man. You're out, mate. Sorry, dog. Uh, sorry. I'm sorry. It was a good try, though. Sorry. Whew. <laughs> Next. <laughs>